Assalamualaikum everybody, I'm back with another video here today. Today we're going to be making um, mashed potatoes, uh, homemade mashed potatoes and macaroni. Before we start the video, I want to thank you guys for everything. Um, hope you guys are doing well. Hope you guys are doing well from Corona. Like, hope you guys are staying safe from Corona. Um, anyways, before we start the video, I was going to talk about, I'm going to talk about how, like, the mashed potatoes are homemade and how about, like, we're going to be mac making macaroni. The whole reason why we're doing this is because my dad's making um, grilled chicken right now. Just like the day when uh, Rafi made grilled chicken, it's kind of like the same spices. Kind of like it. My dad likes to put in a, a few extra, but that's for a secret. But anyways, we're going to start the video here. Um, hope you guys enjoy the video. Yeah. So we already got our water boiling. So what you guys want to do is you guys want to get a pot, a big pot. For the ma all the macaroni, we're gonna get a big pot. Pour 12 cups of water in there, and then uh, we got two cups of macaroni, and we're gonna pour all of this in there. Make sure your water is boiling. Um, boiling point is around like 100 degrees Fahrenheit. So you guys wanna put your um, macaroni inside the pot, and we are going to mix it around a little bit, even it out. And what we're gonna do is we are going to be cooking this for eight minutes. We're gonna leave that there for eight minutes. So next thing is next, while we're cooking our macaroni, we are going to get one, two, three, four, five, six, six potatoes. <laughs> um, just match the sizes, you know. But next thing is next, we're going to be boiling our potatoes till it's tender in the inside. And first thing you guys wanna do is you guys wanna get a small pot for these potatoes, we're going to pour three cups of water we're going to be uh we added in here and we are going to put in our one two three four five six six potatoes <laughs> and make sure you don't splash water over yourself kind of like what i just did there boom boom and boom we are going to be cooking this for 15 minutes um we're gonna cook it actually until it gets tender so 15 minutes around there um and then we're gonna leave we're gonna cover it and let the boiling water tender our potatoes now we took our macaroni out of our pot this is what your macaroni should look like so far now the next step is we're gonna do is we're going to be adding taste into it of course we have to we can't just eat a plan okay so first thing you guys want to do is you guys want to like you can use the same pot, but you want to get the same size kind of pot, whatever. We're going to um, get it on medium heat. Um, that should be good enough. First things we're going to add is we're going to be adding four tablespoons of Blue Bonnet um, butter. <laughs> I can't, I like forgetting to say it. Um, there you go. That should be good enough. Next thing is, is we're gonna do, we're gonna take one and a half cup of half and half. So this is one cup. So we're just gonna take one and a half of half and half. This should be good enough. And we're gonna add half more, which this should be good enough. Next we're going to be adding is half of heavy whipping cream. This half is all you need of heavy whipping cream. Heavy whipping cream. Oh God, it looks thick. <laughs> Anyways, we're gonna... Now, as you guys can see, our butter is melted. You see these bubbles in there? That was the butter that just popped up on top. Next, we're going to be adding our cheese packets that came with our macaroni. So we're gonna pour all of that in. And make sure you get every single piece of cheese out in each bag that came in. Kind of like what I just did right there. And we are going to mix this in. Make sure you guys mix very well. Next, after pouring in our cheese, we mixed it We mixed it very well. And now it should start looking like this. There's cheese in the bag. Now we're going to add our macaroni inside. Now we're going to be mix, mixing our um, macaroni together. It kind of got a little st stuff, so. 
now our macaroni is done so you guys can turn off the heat there you guys go and we're gonna let this sit for a little bit so it gets like cold so we can um not that cold but like till it cools down a little bit since that's really hot now we took out our potatoes that were boiling in the water we left them in there for uh, 15 20 minutes around there and then we peeled them my mom skinned them and what we did is we um, peeled them and everything. Now we are going to be mashing them. <clears throat> but first thing, we're gonna mash them a little bit. Like, we're gonna mash them up first. Kinda like what I'm doing right here. Next I'm gonna add is to um, make it more silkier is heavy whipping cream, again, right here. We're gonna add a half a cup of heavy whipping cream. That should be good enough. Now we are going to add a pinch of black pepper. That should be good enough. And we are going to add um, a little sprinkle of salt, like a little like, like kind of like this, hold up. Now we are going to mix it in our mashed potatoes. This is going to turn out good. I definitely recommend you guys should try it. I just tasted the macaroni a little bit. Oh my god, it tastes good. Like, wow, guys. You guys should definitely try the macaroni that I made. And um, the mashed potatoes. I hope this is going to go well. And we're going to add a little bit more um, of heavy whipping cream. I added a quarter teaspoon of um, salt a little bit. Now we're gonna turn our heat on for like on medium heat. And we're gonna take um, blue bonnet butter right here. And we're gonna be putting in like one uh, spoon of butter right here. One and a half actually. That should be good. Now make sure you guys mix very well. Now we are done with our um, homemade mashed potatoes and our macaroni. We're um, going to taste test it. Also, we're gonna go, uh, show you guys the chicken my um, abu slash dad made. Abu is another abbreviation for dad in our language. And um, my mom also made um, chawo, which is a, a, AKA rice. We also have some cucumbers here. Cu cucumbers here, not cucumbers, because it is good for you and because you need vegetables once in your life. Um, yeah. Now, I'm going to taste the macaroni first, which is probably the longest thing we've taken on this journey. Wow, this tastes really good. It tastes like um, macaroni. <laughs> That's what it tastes like. Um, it's very cheesy. It's not too salty either. It tastes creamy, mostly like silky and creamy all the time. Um, next thing we're going to try is the mashed potatoes, which tastes really good tastes like from bob evans mashed potatoes mixed with um red lobster mashed potatoes that's what it tastes like and even if you're watching from pakistan you probably don't know what those uh, restaurants even mean but eventually when you get to come over here maybe you can try it but anyways that's where i'm gonna end the video here today hope you guys enjoyed it please leave a like and subscribe peace